Hello everybody, my name's Kurt. My name's Jezebel. And we're all out of bubblegum and we're continuing where we left off last time with 007's Goldeneye of the N64. This time we're trying not to die and we know where the ignition now is. Now I know where the key is, I'll blast through this mother like a uh, bear through picnic baskets. Great job. Yeah. <laughs> all right, let's, out that one. Let's, uh, let's get it popping, let's, let's get, get it locking. They see me rolling. Man, I hate them. The only thing I'm hating is those low poly faces. Stretch that texture right. Oh! I have some tired mines. Mines! Oh, leave them behind you. I forgot they were there. You can leave them behind you, that's, that's great. Got some hand grenades, okay. Now we know we've got like, that dash. Well, it shouldn't, be, it shouldn't be a problem now at this time if I just um, get the key. Um, Not just get our tank. Yeah, man. It's on the desk, so you can see it now. <gasps> God! I'm sorry, guys, I ate a lot earlier. I'm also you disgusting. <laughs> Got that ambition key. Let's do it. Oh, I need them time Let's make, Just make it swift. I'm gonna bust for that tank. Don't even bother with the tank, just ran no, out. The tank makes me indie indi 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 killable. Does it? Indie killable. No, it doesn't. But it, it's, I was killing people before it was cool. It'd be well easier because I'll just get in there, I'll just blow shit up and just drive straight up to the plane and get out and get in. Fucking real nice. Be a wild tank action. <laughs> we can't not steal that guy's material. <laughs> so damn funny. Yes, I appreciate his comic sensitivities. I've never enjoyed food reviews because they've always taken themselves too seriously. But geez, that guy is. Uh, what's gee whiz. What's his actual name? I said it in a video. I think it's something like Dustin or something like that. So you see how he's he, yeah, he's a, he's a pretty uh, he's a pretty chill, cool guy. Um, yeah. Done. I like his video. Yeah. See, see that? That's literally two minutes work. You know what? Um, do you want to take the next level? Because I feel like although you got to play in a tank, that's a bit of a cop tease, isn't it? Really? Yeah, it's a bit of a shit bird of a level. Um. I completed all of that, mate. You did. On Her Majesty's Secret Service, that means good. On her mad sweet stack. That's it. I got 50% <laughs> accuracy, I'm better than you. Head hits two in a tank. Come on, man. I think, that, I think it's that blood a shot in the face. Probably, yeah. Right at the very beginning. <laughs> right at the beginning. <laughs> you basically ate the fucking barrel. Seven Iron Bunker, been. mate. This is the best level. Oh, yeah. Power down communications disc. Dish. 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 And enter the base via the ventilation tower. I like towers. Who doesn't like a bit of ventilation in tower form? Oh, I suspect nobody. Look at that. It's beautiful. I'll tell you what, that skybox is actually quite good. I mean, the trees are completely two dimensional. But Look at me, I've got a hood and everything. <laughs> if you watch the intro for this game, for James Bond, instead of cutting to him in like a tuxedo, like it, it goes through all like, the different characters and does like cool like sweeping poses. Instead of for James Bond, he's there in a tuxedo with his gun. It's him in that fucking hoodie, looking like David Bailey, like with like a gun. <laughs> and everyone else is like in their normal costume, but he's in a fucking parka. You can't tell it's James Bond. He just looks like a mess. Oh, I don't think. I feel like this game. They were like, look, lads, the movie's been out for two months. We gotta get this game done. And they were like, oh, it's not ready! And they were like, nah, do it. Uh, um, they just uh, didn't bother programming and aiming properly. I've got to be objective about yeah. it. I, I, I literally guy. think it was just, they thought it was good. It is good. I mean, look, we're, we're oh, having God, fun. We're so brilliant. Look, look, what we've done. look what we've created. We're genius. And then they're not. Oh, yeah. From, from a modern standpoint, it is bad, but you got to think... Oh, at the time, it was brilliant. But yeah, this is like, this has never been done before. This is like, this is one of the first, first person shooters. Correct me if I'm wrong, Dog Hunt doesn't really count. Um, so yeah, N64 was like breaking ground, it was fucking, it was crazy town. It's the birthing age of modern gaming. Yeah, yeah, for sure. Do you the door's locked, mate, it's locked. <laughs> it's made from wood, let me kick the fucker in. <laughs> I'm James Goddamn Bond. Please reload, you got one shot. 
I'm gonna use it to its fullest capabilities. Fucking miss, please. <laughs> so I ah, hit him. Ah, you but shot then he, me. See, he was reloading, so. So ah, hang on, mate. Let me get on. Yeah, you're gonna get. Oh, I'm dead. <laughs> I'm literally spoiled for choice in terms of structures to run towards. I'll go see how many there are. Look, it's, it's mental. That one looks important, mate. That looks like an observatory or something. Probably new like Nothing in there. Right. Got them stairs. Those stairs look possibly important. It's a John on his way to go down there. No, wait, wait, wait! There might be secrets. <laughs> There's not even enemies. Oh, level design. Level design. I could write a book. I could write a book about it. In fact, I might. I'm gonna fucking call up some people. I'm okay, heading for this this shack over the right. I'll tell you what is good about this level. That simulated slush. That is exactly oh, good, yeah. what wet snow looks like. And by wet snow, I don't mean water. I mean shitty wet that snow. That slushy. What the fuck? <laughs> it's like that slushy, like. Not oh, even a fucking yesterday. stool or some shit. <laughs> Just like here, have room. <laughs> it's, it's, it's empty shack. You do what you want. <laughs> At least it's not snow cave. No, <laughs> it's no fire to keep you warm or nothing. <laughs> like, That's what the body heat's for. Oh, yeah. Get him! Oh, you got the club and swearing on the key. key. That was that there uh, locked cabin. Do you know what oh, it would be for? Grenade launcher. Jesus shit. Do you know what it would be for? It would be for the large chest. So you can get the new weapon. Five it's stars. not a big key. <laughs> Should be. Do you know what? I'd pay money to see a James Bond Zelda crossover. <laughs> it's just like Ganon's there. He's like, oh, I'm gonna destroy grenade. you. And he's just like, look at this grenade launcher. That's some, that's some sexy grenade launcher. It looks like a Bionic Commando's arm. That's. Brian Locke, one over there. Is that a living person? That is. How have I got this far and left a man alive? I think it's a woman. It's not. Sure. Yeah, sure. <laughs> Went straight through him and he's like, huh? <laughs> like it blasted a hole in him because it came out at such a high velocity. Yes. You got another key. Yay. Go get the other yeah, computer. Didn't do <sighs> Safe key. Jesus. I know I had to get the key, I was just seeing if the computer did anything as well. Put it in the room with the key. Oh, wait, 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 go back. Let's just take a second to appreciate. Go back into that doorway. Okay, now turn around and slowly go back out. Look up, look up. That's not half bad. That looks good. Just that's the Nintendo polish. That's 2D. It is, but why bother putting it in? Because that's gives it something. They could have possibly fleshed out those trees a bit, but you know. Do you, do you want to be on the trees? Nothing. Rocks. Really? No. <laughs> I don't know. I thought that was like as a as a as a that was a reference to um, someone's uh, someone DMing a game of Dungeons and Dragons who was really dead set on nobody ever going anywhere other than where he wanted them to. And they wanted to try and go through. You put them in this really densely forested forest, and they forested to, forest. Yeah, man. <laughs> they wanted to go through the trees. It seems like no, no, the trees are too tightly packed together. and can't get through them. Like, That's yeah, well, we're going to we're going to take forever to uh, we're going to we're going to cut our way through. And like, yeah, fine, yeah, you could do that. You could spend time doing that. So, okay, we we'll, we'll cut through the trees. What, what what's what's on the other side? So, the other side, trees are rocks. Harsh, tall, sharp rocks. Jeez, that's almost as bad as what I used to do. Everything's large. <laughs> yeah. Like oh, the key I picked up. Did not have a great vocabulary <laughs> or a lexicon of fucking out. What's that sound of snapping twigs? Okay, let's okay, let's tell the story of what's that sound of snapping twigs. Because it's kind of a family in joke about Dungeons and Dragons, which is possibly the nerdiest sentence I could possibly say. But Do you know what though? It might have to wait till next time. Really? Yeah. Let's get into Ooh. That. Yeah, I can see you're hanging on the edge of your seat, but don't worry, we'll be back. So what we're going to do is we're going to... Oh, I love that I found the safe. We're gonna, all right, we're going to not open the safe. I open the safe. Bitch. See you next time. <laughs> Bye.